about the importance of nature and how looking at it can show us God's love. But first, let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for allowing us to see another Sabbath day and for providing us with this online platform so that we can still meet and talk about your love. I pray that we may learn something new today, not only from children's story, but as well as from the um, sermon. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. So let's look at Job 12, verse 7 to 10. But ask the animals, and they will teach you. Or the birds in the sky, and they will tell you. Or speak to the earth, and it will teach you. Or let the fish in the sea inform you. Which of all these does not know that the hand of the Lord has done this? In his hand is the life of every creature and the breath of all mankind. God created the heavens and the earth in seven days. With that, there are so many different ecosystems, animals, and biomes. And all of this shows us how good God is to us. All we have to do is take time to look at his creation and look at the beauties and the wonders of it. Let me show you some things that I looked at and noticed to see God's glory.
took the time to sculpt, mold, and form the seas, the trees, the skies, the animals, and us. But the best part about this is found in Matthew 6 verse 26. Look at the birds of the air. They neither sow nor reap, nor gather into barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not of more value than they? Just like God took his time creating nature, he took his time with us. He promises us that he will take care of us just like he takes care of the beauties of nature because we're beautifully and wonderfully made. Doesn't that make you feel special? Before we pray, I want to encourage you guys to go take some time today to go outside and specifically focus on something in the nature. Look at the skies, look at the trees, look at the grass, and find something that sticks out to you so that you can remember the promises that God has made us. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for making us beautifully and wonderfully. Thank you for giving us a spirit of courage and not fear. I pray that we may look at the nature and remember the promises that you have given us. Help us to remember that you are powerful above all else. In Jesus' name I pray, amen.